Well, hello there, everybody. It is I, Walmart Mario, and today we are back out in Construction Simulator. Now, in this episode, well, we're going to leave off where we left off, as per usual. Uh, in the last episode, we got rid of uh, an old gas tank, and now we're going to do something interesting with it. They didn't really explain what, but uh, I'm kind of excited to get deeper into this because it's getting pretty interesting. I actually love how complex some of these jobs have been, and I'm excited to go further. Ah, uh, back at the motel where we've done pretty much everything to this place. Uh, okay. Park behind the motel. What kind of shady stuff are we doing now? This is getting exciting. And as per usual, Hape's just standing somewhere doing seemingly nothing, but he's always somewhere. Ah, perfect timing. Thank you. The preparations are underway. I'm sure you're wondering what exactly we're up Definitely, to. Definitely, Hape. Well, it's like this. We need something specific to keep this town from going completely under. So an old so rusty we'll tank is what we need. Here and special effects there. And presto, we'll have swarms of tourists coming for a peek at their cameras. What the? I, I have an old the gas tank. a place that we already set up for our plan. We just need your help to put the final piece in place. Okay, now I'm very curious. By morning. Okay, well, I guess it's nighttime now. Um, don't know anything more about what we're doing. He's very vague, but I guess it's for tourism. And they're using an old gas tank. Great. He also said I should drive out of the city without anyone seeing this. Why, why am I hiding an old gas tank? I'm so confused. Okay, now I'm in the middle of nowhere in the, uh, well, it looks like it's almost going to be morning time now. Also, they call this the crash site. I... I think I know what we're doing. If, if we're doing what I think we're doing, this is just a, a, a full-blown lie. And I think we're making a fake UFO crash. I mean, that's the only thing I could assume. All right, enter the backhoe. Let, let, let's find out. That or there's like a dead body in this tank or something. I have no idea why else I'd have to be so secretive. Am I stuck in here? I'm in a backhoe. How am I stuck? Oh, a golden hammer. I didn't even see it until now. Sick. All right, hold on. Time out. I have to go grab those. Because collections are important. I wonder if I do get anything for doing this. Okay, and the final 2%. And we have a grave where we can bury a body. Perfect. Clear the marked area. Don't worry, I am. Oh, unidentified flying object. Wait, what do I do? <laughs> I called it. This whole town is built on a lie at this point. If this is what brings people back to this town... This is a sad town, man. <laughs> um, Is this not what I'm supposed to do? Do I have to go find a UFO? All right, I'm just going to let it go. And I mean, I would assume I have to like bang on it. Is there a flying saucer somewhere? Why is this still here? I mean, I've already gotten it. The thing is, I can skip task. I feel like it. I, 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 either I'm dumb and I just missed something obvious. Or it's glitched. So I'm just going to have to skip task. This may incur cost for materials. Yeah, that's fine, I guess. I mean, I guess you do have to make a UFO for me. So, god damn it. Oh, would you look at that? There's a UFO. What, what am I supposed to do with the tank now? It was supposed to be the UFO. <laughs> All right. Well, a job well done. I've made a UFO out of nothing. Let's get home and get hopefully paid at least a little bit. Hello, Hape. How's it going? What is this place? Oh, wait. Oh. <gasps> Goomba Stomping Inc. Is this my... Is, oh my god, this is all mine? Oh, there's so much room for activities. I think we finally did it. I think we beat the tutorial. Can I come out, please? Thank you. Hape! Did I do it? At last. There you are. Now all we have to do is keep our mouth shut. And oh, I will keep my mouth happens. shut. I didn't even know where but to find that UFO. as certain as the sun rising in the morning. The people in this town love rumors and headlines. Soon, everyone will be talking about the glowing object from another world. I'm sure of that. And all thanks to your help. Good job. Listen, to be honest, I'm pretty satisfied with what I've done with my life. Okay. My career has been rock solid, but I also think it's high time that I retire. You just randomly decided to do my that now. business is small, but in good shape, and it needs someone to pick up the reins. And I honestly can't think of anyone better for this job than you. So, what do you say? I'd stick around for a while to help until you're on your feet. Sounds Deal. good, Hape. Sounds good. A free business for me. I am happy with that. All right, we just got to press G to acquire a company. It's as simple as that. Congratulations on running your very own company. 
If you want it to succeed, you should stop by regularly and familiarize yourself with everything. What? I recommend stop by where? You first Here? take a close look at the upgrade levels and start meeting the goals listed there. It's the only way to qualify for the big jobs in town, uh, so you can so someday do basic leave ones behind. You should also take a look at the vehicle fleet and the finances to see what it takes to manage your construction equipment and get an overview of your financial situation. But the most important thing is fulfilling the orders. It's the only way you can make money to keep expanding your business and afford new construction equipment. So get to it. All right, so let's move on to a contract. I can't move on to the campaign until I own three construction machines and buy a second premise. So it sounds like we can own actually quite a large company in this game, but I can do contracts. Uh, land development, commercial building, a parking lot. All right, I don't know much about these. They're all 100,000 credits. Uh, I'm assuming the less stages, the easier it is. That's probably not the case, but let's do this. Okay, so I guess we're using our tractor for this. I still have dirt in this. Can I just dispose of this? Some you know what? I don't want to dispose of it here. I'm just going to dispose of it on the road. So yeah, I have to go rent things right now. Oh, God. Oh, the brakes on this are not the best. And now I have to worry about damage because I actually have to pay for that. Okay, but this is exciting. I can finally do whatever the hell I want. And uh, if I screw up, it's all on me now. Um, but yeah, we do have to actually earn money in this game. So, oh, God, Jesus. So that's going to be a big goal of mine for the start. The more money we have, uh, obviously, the more toys we can buy. So uh, is this where I rent things? Oh, I can enter it. Okay. Hello. I need a trailer, please. Okay, so it's just a menu. And this is very much like Farming Simulator. Um, we at least can kind of see how in-depth this game... Oh, my God. Why are some of these grayed out? Are these things that I have to unlock? This is insane. Oh, no. It just keeps going. Oh, wait. I think it's resetting. Is it resetting? Yes. Okay, because I already saw the coop. Still, that is a lot of different things we can play with. So this gets me excited. All right, so I need any sort of trailer, it looks like, and then a couple for my tractor. Okay, the cheapest are these multi-trailers. So I'm going to rent this bad boy for 800 credits. Again, the cheaper, the better. I don't think we need something big for this, and I need a couple now. Where do I buy couples? Oh, this is... I think it's a brand. Or uh, as long as it has this emblem, we are good. Yeah, so there's different emblems I'm understanding for every type of equipment. Again, similar to Farming Simulator of all things. So it's looking like these three... I mean, there's... I don't like that it sorts by brand, though. I just want the cheapest. All right, I'm just going to get the Mac Anthem just because I love the name of it. So we'll rent that bad boy for 1600 And I'm hoping I'm doing this right. Again, this is my first job alone, so we'll see what happens. I guess I didn't need to bring this tractor here. I, th I thought I was using this, but uh, I don't think we're going to use that for this job. But it's nice to know we can rent things, so I don't need to buy all these really expensive things that I probably won't use much. And uh, hopefully this is all that we need. What? What the f... Remember, traffic violations are not welcome here. Either drive sensibly and obey traffic rules in the system menu or escape. Oh, man, I am not dealing with that. I am sorry. I mean, I love simulators, but screw that. Traffic offenses, no. I just like to get where I need to go. <laughs> Can't believe that's a thing. Man, I gotta go all the way across town with this freaking traffic right now. I am screwed. Okay, I think the first job was a mistake. I didn't expect to have to go all the way across town. All right, one of your finest prefabricated walls, please. Enter the prefabricated wall factory and buy the prefabricated walls. Okay, I guess you just don't load them for me. I gotta go in there. All right, and it's as simple as that. We just have a pre-built souvenir stand that I can buy. So we'll purchase that, load that package. Oh, this is so easy. I love this. And just like that, we are loaded up. We gotta stop and get building materials. I thought this... Isn't this building materials? What the freak do you mean? Oh, God, I'm sorry. I can't. I took that turn way too hard. That was fun, though. All right, well, that was like 20 minutes of driving. Uh, and we're back to where we always are, at the motel. So, wait. Are, whoa, oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Oh, man. Okay. To be fair, driving is a little difficult in this game. The physics are quite decent. I still am worried I'm going to have to pay, like, a major fee or something, though. Anyways, uh, let's go get some materials here. All right, so all the materials for the active job are color-coded. This game thinks of everything, you know? I, I hate going through menus and buying things that I need. Just tell me what I need and give it to me. That's all. All right, what the... Oh, my God. There's so many things. There, what, what did it say? It was blue or red? It was red. It was red, right? I, mean, I got to assume those are the things. So rebar. Got it. 
ceiling components. Got it. Is that everything? I think that's everything. All right, so we can deliver to yard, to warehouse, or to construction site. Um, oh, how far is it? I don't know. Where, where's my yard? Oh, I'm so cheap. You know, it's it's 870. Just, just go to the construction site. I do like that you have options, though. That's so cool. All right, so we got everything there. And thank God this isn't too far away. Excuse me, everybody. I'm more important than you. Just get out of my way. Thank you. You can use a crane to place construction materials. Cranes may only be set up in the crane area. You didn't tell me I needed a freaking crane. What the frig, man? Oh, wait. My other truck has a crane on it. So I guess we just got to bring that over. Okay, I'm here. Am I supposed... I should probably grab these. I know I'm going to have to drop them off. So before we go over there... Wait, I wonder. Hold on. I wonder. Saving time, baby. There you go. <laughs> I'm so glad this crane has a mega extension on it. Can I make it? I right, just gotta, just gotta throw it over there. There. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna have to bring the other one with me. I think. Wait. Oh my god. Oh god damn it. So there is a crane here. I gotta build it. You don't have a suitable crane. You can. Holy crap, game. What the? What do you mean? Why didn't you tell me to build it when I was there? Okay, I doubt this will work, but I am way too cheap to go buy a really expensive crane if I don't need to. And God damn it, I am committed to trying with this little guy. Well, I can connect to it, so maybe I can save some money after all. Wow, this thing can pick up this? This doesn't feel safe. This doesn't feel safe at all. And away we... Oh, oh, we, easy. This thing is really fast. I swear it's, it's only partially me. Screw you and your fancy big cranes. I'll use the one I was given. From good old Gabe, or the name I always forget. Gate? 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 I don't remember his name. Well, there we go. Now we have to interact on the transport frame to release the prefabricated walls. <laughs> Am I actually going to be able to do this with my basic crane? <laughs> I didn't think it would work. All right, unlock. Why can't I do it? Oh. Oh, my God. Where, where's my head? Okay. Oh. That was horrifying. Okay, what am I doing? What, what am I doing? What... There's not even a place to place these. I should probably go buy the crane that I'm supposed to buy. Oh, there it is. I was on top of it. Okay, maybe I can actually do this. All right, and here is one. I don't think I'm going to be able to get that back wall. I don't have much extension left. But thankfully, it's very easy to place these. All right, we got to extend as much as we can. So nice and straight. Come on. <laughs> it's not happening, man. It is not happening. Uh, what happens if I reset with this? Oh, well, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, you know what? I'm accepting defeat. We're gonna go after buy the stupid crane that, from what I understand, it, did, it didn't tell me to buy. I could be wrong, though. All right. Fast er erecting crane. Oh, nice. Fast erecting. My style. Okay, I think I need something basic. So, probably the 1941. It, again, it never showed me to buy a freaking crane. So, let's get the fast erecting. I hope that's big enough. If not, I am just wasting money. Uh, the good thing is you can actually buy online in this game, so I don't have to actually go anywhere. So it was way easier than I thought. Oh my god, it costs that much to set it up. It's a fast erecting one. I thought it was cheap. The crane area is blocked. I will accept that. Wait, what? Is it because of me? I've already moved it. What? what? Is it me? Oh, it was me. Okay. Okay, look at this cute little big crane. Oh, this is so much easier. Why Why did I have to try and do it the other way? I mean, to be fair, I did quite well with it with my small crane. I also love that the game just kind of lets you do whatever the hell you want. If you want to be dumb and do things the hard way, the game's not going to tell you not to. And I appreciate that as a fellow dumb person. <laughs> okay, there we go. We got that. This should be a quick job now. Looks like we're just putting scaffolding on the roof. We don't need to, like, nail these in or anything, I don't think. I don't think it's that realistic. And I kind of like that. I, I I I like these quick jobs. Okay, my depth perception's way off. <laughs> and voila, we have a roof. Now what? Place ceiling, clear the marked area. What now? What am I clearing? The crane can now be dismantled again. It works exactly. Okay, so all I had to do was just that with the crane. Well, that was five thousand well spent. God, actually six thousand if you think about it, because uh, it was actually seven thousand because it was two thousand to rent. 5,000 to install. Oh my god. Oh my god. It costs... It costs 5,000 to... Go away? 
Crane area is blocked. What the freak? Okay, there we go. <laughs> a little confusing. Transport concrete. All right, well, we need a concrete mixer for that. So we'll go back to my favorite store, the vehicle dealer. I'm going to enter it. Concrete mixer. Dude, dude, I'm going to go broke on this freaking job. Actually, never mind. I just earned $60,000 somehow. So I, I, I guess I get paid every task I do for a job. I kind of love that. All right, well, maybe we can spend some money after all. That's an asphalt dumper. Um, we have a mixer here. You know what? I'm not going to waste time trying to find the best deal. I have things to do. The faster we work, the, the, the more we get paid. Okay, let's fill this thing up. Should I fill it? I don't know how much. I don't even know what I need concrete for. Probably the foundation, I'm assuming. But you know what? I should probably just fill it just to play it safe. Whoa. And done. That was 13,000. See, that's the thing. Like, it should, I wish it told me how much concrete I need. It's not like that's cheap. Okay, concrete's here. I'm starting to run out of space. So this has to need a concrete pump. You know by now where to get construction machines. What the frig? Why wouldn't you tell me to get that first? Oh, let me... You know, screw it. I'll deal with this later. We must go buy a concrete pump. Oh, my God. Another vehicle? Why is there so many vehicles that I need? Okay, we're going to rent that for a day. And we'll just have every freaking vehicle at this site. All right, your pump is here. Switch to function mode and then open the lid via the context menu. Okay. I accidentally got out of the car. Function mode. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is this going to be big enough? Holy. I didn't think concrete pouring would be so serious. All right, now we open the hopper. And, I mean, I think I understand how this works. We pour one in another. And then we make money, right? All right, that is definitely good. I just don't want to lose any of this concrete. I mean, I paid 16000 for it. All right. Just, ah, this thing, the gearing in this is so hard to get right. Okay, stop, stop. This is... Perfect. Right there. Done. Don't move. All right. Pouring is on. I hope that thing can't overflow because I am going to be slow. But yes, the sweet sound of success. Look at that. It's beautiful. Just got to get through these legs here. And I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, yes. Extend. Extend my... I mean, this seems a little much just to pour concrete. But hey, I'm having fun with it. Big tools are fun. All right, what do I do from here? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's so confusing. Okay, so we're going higher? I don't think we need to go this high, but okay. Oh, my God. How do I... How do I get it over? Oh, my God. Why do we have the world's biggest concrete mixer? What the frig? Okay, this is insane. This is... I mean, this is a one-story building. Can't we just use a bucket? All right, so now we just poop concrete. Pouring is on. Oh, I actually got to direct it. Oh, God. This is dangerous. This is, is this just too much? Is this too much? Okay, I, th I, th I think we're okay. This is so cool. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, pff, pff, oh I swear to God, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> it's, it's just, I mean, it's, it's a lot of buttons to deal with how much this thing retracts. How do I go the other way? Oh, that's down. Okay, I am just wasting concrete at this point. All right, we're at 92%, so we don't need to get perfect, obviously, because there's still a lot on the sides. Filling this hole should hopefully do it. And... 99. Come on. Are you serious? 100. There. Done. Ah, oh, we just have to clear the construction site. Remember to return all rented construction machines. This will save unnecessary extra costs. I was worried about that. I'm glad I read that message. I think I was just hired to do the foundation of the building, and indeed that is there. Okay, I guess I saw the blue tarp in the back. I got excited thinking there's something in here. But yeah, we built, uh, well, the foundation of a building. Okay, but there we go. We have returned all of the things we do not own. And look who showed up at the construction site. Hape himself. What do you think of my first job alone, buddy? Oh, it just turned all the way into a souvenir thing. Yes! Oh, the music! Oh, it feels so good. I, I, I built that. Good job. The L1 tower crane will be a good addition to your fleet. If you decide to buy a construction machine, you can purchase it from a vehicle dealer. You trying to tell me something, Hape? I do know I need to buy something soon so I can move on to a medium-sized company. But let's just chill out a little bit. We just did our first job and that's it so far. So yeah, guys, I think it's a good time to wrap up this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed playing with UFOs and souvenir stations. And uh, yeah, I gotta say, I'm loving everything about this game. Uh, it's absurdly complex. And just judging by the different types of jobs we can have, I think there's going to be a bunch of different types of construction things we can do. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the journey that is Construction Simulator. And yeah, as always... 
Thanks for watching and liking, guys. I'll see you in the next one.